Ariana Grande opens up about the Manchester bombing. Last year, the world was left in shock when a terrorist detonated a bomb inside the Manchester arena after the singer finished her concert. The bomb killed 22 people, including former Attitude contributor Martin Hatt, and with the year anniversary on May 22, Ariana has admitted in a candid interview it is still painful for her every day. Speaking to Time magazine, she said, The last thing I would ever want is for my fans to see something like that happen and think it won. Music is supposed to be the safest thing in the world. I think that's why it's still so heavy on my heart every single day. I wish there was more that I could fix. You think with time it'll become easier to talk about. Or you'll make peace with it. But every day I wait for that peace to come and it's still very painful. Earlier this month, Ariana released her first single since the terrifying and horrific attack, No Tears Left to Cry. And although she hasn't publicly said the song is about the bombing, the official video includes a moving nod to Manchester in the form of a bee, the city's symbol, which flies away at the video's close. Watch the official video below.